Tonight we're here in Belfast at the Clayton Hotel for the GNI MAG Awards. Daniel is the main man behind it all. How did the whole thing come about? Good evening, thank you for coming. Um, GNI itself started about six years ago um, as a, a tiny wee magazine and thankfully we've grown over the past six years into an established glossy magazine you can get it across the province and we're here tonight to hold our second annual award so it's, it's great, yeah, there's plenty of buzz. And the LGBT community are very, very supportive, as are everyone else now, so we're, we're really happy that tonight's happening. Tell us what awards categories have all been voting for. Oh, there's, there's all sorts. There's, there's like Best Dressed, um, Best Entertainer, Nightlife Venues, um, there's retail awards. There, there's everything that you, would, you can imagine that you, you would see in a typical magazine. Um, and in votes, on final count, before we close them on Tuesday, we were just, just hitting 50,000 votes, so it's absolutely amazing. Wow. 50,000 votes in less than kind of three and a half weeks. That is brilliant, mm. brilliant stuff. Okay, so we're just getting ready for the start of the awards yes. right now. Who all's here tonight? Who's coming? Well, to be honest, the majority of people here, there's about 180 nominees and about 90 sponsors, so about 270 people in total from various aspects of businesses that are all supporters of the LGBT and work here in Northern Ireland. Fabulous. Daniel, have a great night. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm joined now by the host with the most. It's only Julian Simmons. How are you, sir? One of the hosts. <laughs> a, a lovely lady called Trudy's joining me to, to host this. So, should be good fun. Brilliant. So, are you looking forward to getting out there tonight on well, stage? I, I, I am now. I had a mad panic there because I picked up my stuff when I came in from London at lunchtime went into UTV to do my job and record everything and then went to get myself ponced up for this event. And I was taking everything off and getting myself sorted and I realised I'd left the jacket bit at home. Right. So we had to charge up the road like bats out of hell, yeah. you know, and I mean the traffic was so awful and now I'm here and I can relax. You're here tonight, looking fabulous. You must be up for the best dressed category tonight, well, are you? I don't think I'm, I don't think it's the best dressed category. No, I'm not. But it's going to be good fun anyway. And the people in the audience are going to be a scream. Brilliant, brilliant. And will you be partying late into the evening? Well, I'm working tomorrow, so unfortunately I'll have to clip my wings because I've done that, you know, been out, been on the Raz, and then tried to sit on TV the next, and you're dying. And I'm never, ever, ever doing it again. Because you're sitting there talking away to the camera and all you want to do is book, <laughs> you know? So there's no way I'm going to be doing that ever, ever again. Julian, great talking to you as always. Nice Have a fabulous you night. Too. I'll do my best. You too. Thank you. So you couldn't do an awards ceremony like this without the help of uh, some sponsors. Santander is uh, the big sponsor. What was it that made you want to get involved in tonight? We're really delighted to be supporting the GNI Awards tonight because we're an organisation that cares really deeply about our people and our customers and I believe that great businesses are businesses that are diverse and inclusive and this is one of the many ways that we show our support for the LGBT community. We're really proud to be here, we're really proud to, ha to have an evening to celebrate all the success of these colleagues. So a bit of a homecoming for you tonight, Colin. You don't get back to Northern Ireland that much these days, do you? Well, do you know something? It's just brilliant to be able to kind of combine home and work. And I've got my mum here tonight, which I'm so excited about. Uh, but just to come home to Belfast for such a prestigious award surrounding the LGBT community is, is such a fantastic, fantastic reason to come home. I'm really glad to be here. Now, every time I see you on social media, you're busy singing these days, but singing your own material, and it sounds amazing. Oh, thank you so much. Um, yes, I've been writing my own material now for about 18 months, and uh, it's always so nerve-wracking to put your own stuff out there, because when you sing other people's material, you know it's good. Yes. And then when you sing your own, and it gets a great reception, it's, it's brilliant. Uh, and uh, the Northern Irish crowd has been really receptive and really welcoming to my material. So I'm um, actually releasing my debut album next April. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I'll get to come home to Northern Ireland and uh, do a lot of promotional appearances and uh, performances surrounding that. So what can we expect from the album? Is it all going to be songs written by you? Yes, uh, I've written seven songs so far and it's been 100% my writing. Uh, I've kind of tested the, the water over in London and it's going down really well. So I'm actually getting, uh, uh, you know, I'm circulating over there as a new up and coming singer songwriter. So to, I can't wait to bring it home. Yeah. You know, that's what I'm excited about. So the glitz and glamour continues. Claire Bailey from the Green Party is with me. How are you tonight? I'm absolutely thrilled to be here. Uh, we've just arrived, but the place is buzzing. There's so many people 
people. I think the atmosphere and the energy is just really electric, and I'm looking forward to the night ahead. And there really is. The moment you walk through the doors here, there's just great atmosphere yeah. in the hotel, isn't there? Yeah, there really, really is. I think they put all the stops out for tonight. And the decor is amazing, and the reception's great. Everybody's in top form, and I'm absolutely thrilled to be not just nominated, but to be here the night to be sucking it all up as well. It's great. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. And will you be partying into the wee small hours? I can't be telling you what I'll be doing in the wee small hours. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great night. <laughs> Thank you very Thank much, you, you too. <laughs> so we need some more glamour and excitement. We've had Julian Simmons, we've had Conleth Kane, and now Miss Tina Legs Tantrum. How are you? Hi, I'm great. How are you? I'm really well. So you're looking forward to the big night tonight? I am indeed, yes. I was here last year and I had such a good time that I can't remember. <laughs> so, um, no, I got a little bit tipsy, but I had a wonderful time. It was the first event. They had the GNI Awards and it was such a huge success and I'm actually flattered to be nominated again and I'm also going to be presenting an award. There's so many young up and coming drag queens who deserve to be recognised now and I mean for what I've received over the last 21 years has been amazing so I just rather like to sit in the background now and kind of sort of you know stamp my feet and scrape the nails and spit a little but no no honestly i would like to see some of the younger ones getting recognition now because they work particularly hard okay let's talk to a man who's actually nominated for one of the awards tonight barra best how are you very well robin how are you doing i'm great thank you love the outfit tonight thank but then again much. it is best dress tonight for you yeah i thought i had to make it a bit of an effort so went out last minute shopping today get a wee bit of a color in the bow tie instead of being a little bit boring i thought i Brighten it up a little bit. Excellent. So, have you seen who else is in the nominations with you? I had a look. You know what? It's a tough competition. Yeah. But it's like every, it's like all of them. You come, you come for the crack. It's just good to be nominated, and you know, you, you get to meet all everyone else. So, you know, hopefully the best person wins. <laughs> Great stuff. And will you be parting into the small hours tonight as well? Well, let's just put it this way: I'll book tomorrow off work. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> so probably. <laughs> Great stuff, Barra. Have a fabulous evening. Thanks very much. You too. Thank you.